a beloved business in Butte that's made homemade candies here in the mining city since 1954, was heavily damaged when a vehicle crashed into the front of the historic business, leaving the owners and many in the community devastated. That was substantial. That yeah. wasn't just uh, taking out a, a little corner of the building. That That's removing a whole room. That's uh, severely damaging my inventory and my supplies. Um, so yeah, it's, it's, it's crushing, it's overwhelming, it's, it's hard to believe. Gallardo said a pickup truck heading north on Harrison Avenue smashed into their storefront about 3.30 Saturday morning. The incident took out a room where customers and employees occupy. She said she's just thankful no one was in the building at the time of the crash. Especially at Christmas, I usually have three people working in there. So again, I'm, I'm very glad that, that nobody was in there and that yes, we, we lost materials and we lost inventory and we lost candy, but those things can be repaired. The candy store was opened in that location 69 years ago by Bruce Shepard. Ron Gallardo began working there when he was just 16 years old and is now co-owner. It's a tradition, tradition, tradition of Butte. It's one of the things you do when you come to Butte is get Shepherd's Candy. They put their heart and soul into it. There's no two more giving people in the world than Mary and Ron. It's a challenging time to have an accident like this because this is when the Christmas time rush begins. But the Gallardos say this incident won't keep them down long. We'll get the building shored up. We will deal with insurance adjusters and figure out about repairing it. We, we will not be taking a vacation. We will, we will be getting back up. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.